In all the good times I find myself longing for change And in the bad times I fear myself <laughs> this is why we love Kevin James. He has spent his time during the pandemic uh, putting together these uh, shorts, these little uh, videos in which he inserts himself into famous movie scenes. And uh, Kevin is also coming out on a stand-up tour uh, that will bring him into the Chicago area soon. He joins us right now. Kevin, my friend. <laughs> Hey. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Those are just the best. And they're so, are you editing these? How in the heck are you getting these so perfectly done? I have a group of guys that uh, are, are super talented uh, that I found and uh, they, they do it all. They uh, direct them and edit them and uh, they help write. They're really, really great guys. So we, we uh, like, we're kind of bunkered in for the whole quarantine and uh we just said we're gonna have fun we're gonna make these anyway and you know it's it was like a, a great outlet for us so it was fun yeah the, i mean this is uh i guess this character that you're doing called the sound guy where, you, where you're the audio guy and you go into these <laughs> famous movies that are hilarious uh do, do you, do you yeah. have some favorites uh, that you've done with this um, I, I love the Daniel Day Lewis one. There was one we did with uh, that uh, with him, and uh, just a, a couple with one with Will Smith was fun. We did, uh, you know, and uh, just each one was different. Even some of the smaller <laughs> ones were great, you know. We are going to talk about your stand up uh, coming into Chicago uh, in just a second. But uh, can we just show another one of these? The, the, sure. Your, your spoof of the notebook <laughs> is hilarious. <laughs> Take a look at this. Easy. It's going to be really hard. It can be very easy. And we're going to have to work at this every day, but I want to do that because okay. I want you. I want you. I want all of you forever. Okay. You and yep. me. I'm just trying to get a sound check. you do something for me? <laughs> yep. I'm just trying to get a sound check. Please. Yes. You just picture your life for me. Okay. <laughs> 30 years from now, 40 years from now? I don't now? think I'll be here. What's I don't know if like? I'll be here. I... Go! I'm just asking for a Would second. Would you stop thinking about what everyone wants? Stop thinking about what I want, what he wants, what your parents want. What do you want? What do you want? I just, I just need a, a sound check. Just what me. do you want? Just a sound check would be great. Just a level on you. One. <laughs> what do you want? Just a sound check, Mr. Gosling. It's just the best. Uh, so, okay. Kevin, have you, have you heard from, the, you know, the Ryan Goslings, the Daniel day Lewises, the <laughs> Bradley Coopers, I, any of these guys? I was able to do the, uh, the Daniel day Lewis one. We were able to get uh, Paul Thomas Anderson to do. <laughs> he's he's, a, he's a, a good friend of uh, Sandler's and mine, and, and he, he, uh, he, he, he agreed to uh, be in, in the video, put his voice in there. So he had some fun. We had some fun with that. Uh, it's a great way for me to get into some really good movies, you know? Yeah. <laughs> hey, don't sell Paul Blart short. Hey. I talk about him all the time, still my favorite. Very funny. Thank you, thank you. I'll, I'll take it. <laughs> yeah, maybe maybe one day Daniel Day-Lewis will spoof Mall Cop. Yeah, get That's right. You know, somewhere along the way to right. pay back on this. You are uh, back on the road, back uh, doing stand-up yes. again. What brought this around? Also the I pandemic? Any chance I can do, yeah, it's been a while since the pandemic, so I'm, I'm excited to get back out there. And uh, I was touring just before the pandemic hit uh, with a whole new act and, and, and having fun with it, and that kind of shut us down. So we've been, uh, you know, chomping at the bit to get back out there. And uh, now we, we have an opening in the schedule, and we're uh, excited to get out on tour and do it. Kevin, can I ask you the question that nobody dares ask you, uh, because I'm a journalist and I want to challenge you. I read that you were a college fullback who ran a 4640. Are you kidding me? <laughs> no, I did. I, I was, uh, back in the day, man, I, <laughs> I miss it. That's why a lot of my, uh, a lot of my movies, I like to do physical stuff because I still, you know, 
I love sports. I can't do them anymore like I can't, you know, used to. But uh, yeah, four six forty, and then after college, that's when you know stand up hit and kind of eating cheeseburgers. <laughs> But the fullback is like the unappreciated position on the offense, yes. don't you think? Yes, I was a tailback in high school, and then I, uh, when I went to college, uh, they moved me to fullback. I was a pretty big kid, and uh, you're right. It was a, I was a blocking back, and just you know, got to get that, pick up that uh, just a couple yards, and that that was it. Doing the hard work. That's right. What are people going to see when they come see you doing stand up this time around? Um, you know. Uh, they're going to have a blast and it's and it's it's a great way to i think to kind of get away from all the nonsense in the world and just uh really take a break have some fun uh and and just enjoy life a little bit you know it's 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 great for me it's therapy for me to go out there and uh, to to see live audiences again and 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 to work with them and it's just it's interact it's it's, it's just a blast it really is so it, it should be a lot of fun Kevin's got uh, two shows that'll be at the Rialto Square Theater in Joliet on November the 5th, and then I'll head up to Waukegan for the Genesee. Two beautiful theaters. He'll do uh, a show there on November the 6th. Uh, we've got the, uh, well, the ticket information is at the box offices of the theater. Kevin, thank you so much. Thank you for these videos and all your stand-up and... Uh, I watch uh, King of Queens still all the time, one of the funniest shows around. Great stuff. Thank you so much. Thank you guys so much. Really appreciate it. Thanks, Kevin.